So today I'm going to be showing you how to activate the auxiliary function on a Vauxhall Corsa 2009, Corsa D. Um, as you can see on my head unit, when I press the FM AM button a few times, it gives me option for the auxiliary. And I've got the auxiliary connection just there. <clears throat> so what I'm going to show you is, on the Tech 2, how to activate that function um, you have to have a few numbers which I'm just going to show you the setup of mine at the moment so what you need to know is the code index the audio index and the temperature index just there for you so if you want to take a note of these please take them down to see if it will work with your unit and it also just told you there the production date of my unit as well I do have codes other codes that you can use if they don't work which I'll put down in this description as well so you can use them it's all about just trying it and seeing what works with yourself. So all you need to do on the Tech 2 is if I go all the way back so you can see exactly where I started from. Um, it's literally diagnostics, choose your car, go down to the infotainment system, entertainment head unit, Just wait for that. Turn the ignition on, which mine is, and the head unit's on as well. And I know what those DTCs are, so I don't need to worry about them. We'll confirm on there and confirm. Let's just go back one to back where the entertainment head unit was. On here, if you select the entertainment head unit there'll be another option here that says info so click and confirm on there info will tell you what your current setup is so click on info and it just tells you what your current details are for your car so it'll tell you what your current code index is etc if it's different to what it is on here then just try putting in these numbers see what happens so if I just confirm on here it'll take you through to where you need to go to change those um, various things so confirm on there yep CD30 MP3 so please make sure that your head unit is a CD30 MP3 and make sure it's got the um, aux function on there in terms of on the back metal plate it actually allows you to have an aux on there or you've got the auxiliary already put in um, and this is just how to activate it so then you go down to programming and then program code index program audio index and program temperature index on there for you now when you click on program code index it'll ask you how you want to do it and all you want to do is with aux in click on there so it's saying your current version code version and you want to click on program when you click on program it actually put a number and enter and we're happy with that because mine is exactly as it is but just for purposes yeah that's what we want to do it's activating it please wait So the head unit's just uh, turned off, come back on. It's got AUX on there now. Programming successful. And that's it. And if you just change the other bits and bobs to match what I had on mine, hopefully you should be fine with that. If you have any problems, let me know.